Hey, good morning guys. Today I'm going to be talking about Bland AI. So before we start, let me just show you this clip. Hey, um, this is Bland AI. I'm an AI agent that makes millions of phone calls for businesses and in any voice. What's your name? My name's Mike. What's your name? Nice to meet you, Mike. I'm Bland. I guess you're calling since you saw our billboard, right? Yeah, I am. Great. Well, I guess I should tell you a bit more about myself. I can be programmed to do sales, customer support, or really any type of phone call. What sounds interesting to you, Mike? So this is Bland AI, an AI calling assistant. So here you have their page and they also have enterprise solutions. You can contact them, you can document, uh, you can read their documentation. They also do provide an API, which is very easy to use. They also have integration with Zapier for automations. And they also have the careers, their blog and their turbo demo, their web demo and their pricing. So before we talk about their pricing, let's just look at their interface. So here I'm inside Bland AI and app.blandai. And this is their dashboard. So I would like to just first send a phone call. It's pretty simple and you can start sending your first phone call within a minute. So I'm living in India. So this is my phone number. Please don't call. And here, all I have to do is enter a kind of structure for this conversation. Call saying you are a calling service and mention your intention to get my organization to register for your service. Be extremely polite and ask for as much personal details as possible. So that's it. We're almost good to go. Here we can have the temperature of the model, interruption threshold. Let's increase the interruption threshold to 100 milliseconds. Let's go to 150 milliseconds. Uh, let's test out some public voices and some bland curated cloned voices. I usually go, I like to go with a slower, deeper voice so that people understand. Hey, this is Blandy. How can I help today? That wasn't slow enough for me. Hey, this is Blandy. How can I help today? That was good. So we're going to be using Josh to make this call. And right away, I'm going to take off my phone from silent mode. Okay, so we're ready to go. So we can also add a transfer list. So if your number has a transfer list, we can add, we can add the transfer number as well. Metadata, we can add any additional information we want using a webhook. I'm guessing Zapier would be very useful here. Then the pronunciation guide. The pronunciation guide is an array of object guides that the LLM on how to specify words. This is great for situations with complicated terms and names. So say your uh, brand is in a very complicated domain with complicated words, you would like to add this. And then answered by max duration 12 minutes, wait for greeting, record call. Let's do record call. Webhook URL, we can also add a webhook. Request data, key value pairs. When you know you want your AI to act specific fact like the caller's name or the, okay, so we can extract key value pairs here. So we like to extract name, address, um, occupation. So let's try to get these three details from this call. Send call. And there it is guys, I'm already getting the call. Let me answer and put that on loudspeaker. Hello, this is calling from the registration service. I'm calling to see if your organization would be interested in registering for our service. Could I please get some more information from you? 
Yes, what kind of service? Wonderful, I'm happy to provide more details. Our service helps organizations like yours register and maintain compliance with various government regulations and industry standards. We handle all the paperwork and filings so you can focus on running your business. Could you please confirm your organization's name and address so I can look up your details? Uh, my name is Pratik and I work for a company called Ayota. Okay, great to meet you Pratik. And what is the address for Ayota? The spelling for Ayota is A-Y-O-T-T-A. Okay, thank you for spelling that out for me. And what is the full address for Yota? A-Y-O-T-T-A. I'm sorry, I'm having a bit of trouble understanding the address. Could you please repeat it for me slowly? Ayota, like a small Ayota of particles. Okay, thank you for your time, Pratik. I appreciate you providing that information. Have a great rest of your day. <laughs> yes, so you can see, because our pipeline was so simple, it wasn't um, equipped to handle these errors, which is quite funny. So we can end this call um, and now return to our call logs. And here we can see my outbound call with the recording. The cost of the call, the status of the call, the summary of the Hello, call. This is calling from the registration service. I'm calling to see if your organization... Yeah, so that's the recording. The metadata, the answer calls, the batch, call ended by assistant. User, user, not applicable because they never picked up. So if they don't pick up, it's zero dollars. And if they do have a 33 second... So for one minute, this was on average uh, 0 0.05. So we can say for a minute that's 0 0.1. So that's one cent a minute on average is what we can say. So yeah, guys, this is very useful if your enterprise wants to build a chatbot or wants to be in touch with its clients in a more interactive and data collective sort of way. So I would love for you guys to use this, build it around. So here you can see in their playground, you can build complete conversations. You can also have a list of phone numbers. You can buy a phone number for $15 for inbound or outbound calls. They also have a pretty neat pricing scheme where you can check your billing details. You can have everything ready. And so, yeah, this is pretty simple to use and pretty ready already. So go ahead and try it. Thank you. Catch you in the next one.